Hello and welcome. My name is Felix Service and I'm the sound designer of Dragon Commander. In this episode, we will introduce a system that we established in Dragon Commander to give the player a nice acoustic feedback when he's moving his dragon through the air. When the player is controlling the dragon, this is not something like sitting in the cockpit of a jet. The dragon is an airborne creature that is able to sense all the nuances of the air it is moving through right on its bare skin. We wanted to recreate the sensation and as well the raw power of the jetpack with the audio. It was obvious from the start that wind and air current sounds would be playing a crucial role in here and that they had to be very responsive to all the dragon's movements in the game. We were using Audio Kinetic's Wii-Wise audio engine for this project and luckily this engine could be extended with an optional plugin set called Soundseed Air. This was the perfect solution for our problem. Soundseed Air is basically a set of small synthesizers that are specialized in all kinds of airy sounds. It does not use static samples, but it calculates the sound constantly in real time with very natural sounding random variations. The true power of this plugin lies in its ability to map most of its parameters to so-called RTPCs, which are then changed in-game by the Dragon's Flight Attitude. Let's preview in the VWISE editor how the Dragon's pitch and jaw speed do alter speed, gustiness and direction of the wind noises created by the Soundseed Wind plugin. The Dragon's Wings then feature the Soundseed Whoosh plugin. Similar to the Soundseed Wind plugin, it synthesizes a new sound every time the wings are moving, giving each wing flap a slightly different sound. There are many more aspects of the audio that are controlled by the Dragonfly. To simulate the fight versus the pull of gravity, random panting samples are fading in when the dragon is climbing long enough using his wings. And in jetpack mode, the rocket sound gets altered too. According to the dragon's distance to the ground, ambient sounds are faded in that also switch every time the dragon crosses the shoreline. All these small details are supposed to build a system of ambient and movement sounds that respond immediately to all the player's actions as a dragon. So, see you in game then, and please enjoy flying the dragon as much as we enjoyed creating the audio for it. Speaking of the military, if there's something you don't want to neglect, it's the bids and requests of your generals. Their influence on the battlefield is not to be taken lightly. Have a sherry to calm those nerves. In the Queen's quarters, decorated...